What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Oh yeah, very first episode of the year 2019. Happy New Year's, guys, from me to you guys. And, well, right now I'm recording this at 8.37 New Year's Eve, yeah. So, I'm on time. I just procrastinated just a little bit when I made this episode. Anywho, in the last episode, we actually managed to become the Pokemon League Champion yet again in Johto. And, uh, well, somehow we're here. I don't know. And I, I'm getting a phone call right now. Like, I just moved and it's Professor Elm. Wow. He's like, hello, Draven. I have something here for you. Could you swing by the lab? Uh, see you later. Okay. All right. Okay. So we have to go to Professor Elm's uh, lab. Uh, yeah, I guess if you take two steps, then you can actually get that phone call. So that's exactly what we're going to do right now. Go into the lab and see what's up. Moving on forward, and here we have Professor Realm, and he's like, Draven, there you are. I called because I have something for you. See, it's an SS ticket. Now you can catch Pokemon in Kanto. Okay, what's the difference? Of course, I'm years ahead right now, but he's going to be telling us a few things like, the ship departs in Alvine City, but you already knew that already, Draven. After all, you've traveled all over with your Pokemon. Give my regards to Poke uh, Professor Oak in Kanto. Wow. <laughs> I'm really not that good at reading. I'm sorry, guys. Sorry to disappoint you. Okay, so I guess we're going to Kanto. Anyone going to Kanto? That's right. Okay, so after winning the uh, Pokemon League, we can actually go to Kanto, like the rest of Kanto here. And, uh, well, like it says on the title down below, the champ returns back to his hometown. Or, I don't know, country? Region? I don't know. Is this all one country? I don't know. Okay, so we're gonna go... Wow, I, I passed it. I passed it by. So we're going to go to Olivine City and take care of this. Now, I remember... I remember when I first played Pokemon Crystal, I, I thought that, you know, beating the Elite Four in Johto, that was it. But then I found out you can actually go right here after defeating the Elite Four, and my Pokemon were way overpowered. Or overleveled. Um, I don't know. Probably until we met Red right here. So once you go in here, you guys gonna be like, welcome to the fast ship SS Aqua. Will you be on board or will you be boarding today? Yes, sir. May I see your ticket? And I flash the ticket. Look at that. I'm flashing the ticket. You see? I'm flashing the ticket. That's it. Thank you. Okay, so we're going in and uh, I wonder if there's like a abandoned, uh, abandoned uh, truck right here so we can find Mew. I don't know. We're departing soon. Please get on board. All right, and look at this. Yes, it's Aqua, title, whatever. Look at that. Okay, look at that. All right, we're moving. Things are heating up and bam! Oh, wow. He's like, whoa, excuse me. I was in a hurry. My granddaughter's missing. She's just wee girl. If you see her, please let me know. All right, okay. All right, so, uh, ow. Excuse me. Excuse you. Huh. So, just like the SS uh, and this place is a good place to battle Pokemon trainers. Now, if you go right here, talk to this gentleman, he's like, here's your cabin. If your Pokemon are hurt, take a nap in the bed. That will heal them. All right. So, as you can see, look at that. This is my cabin. Looks pretty awesome. Like, see in the trash right here. No, there's nothing. We have a table. We have a bed. And look at that. We got a PC as well. So, we could actually, you know, switch up our Pokemon whenever we need to. I'm not really going to switch up any of my Pokemon right now. So, let's move on and start battling everybody right here. Is there anybody right here? No, there's nobody here. It's an abandoned cabin. Amazing. Okay, let's go to round, or room three. And this guy look, is looking for a battle. So, who should I start off with first? Kid Thunder? No. You know what? Who should I? Oh, you, you know what? I, I'm, I'm going to go with... We just battled with somebody that's pretty awesome. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go with Teddy right here. Teddy needs some loving. It's been a while, Teddy. And here's our first Pokemon trainer. Are you alone? Then let's battle. Okay. All right. We're going to be battling right now. Bring it on. Bring it on. And here we have Hiker Nolan, and he wants to fight. And he's going to start off with his Sand Slash. That's right. Bring on your Sand Slash, you jerk. And it's level 31. Okay, so we're going to be uh, overpowering you guys just a little bit. And... Uh, I'm gonna go easy on him. I'm gonna go with the return. That's right. Return. Will it finish us off? And yes, it will. Bye bye. There we go. Huh. Kid Thunder getting some more points. 
And he's got another Pokemon right here. He's coming out with his Golem, so I'm gonna go with Nessie right here. Nessie's been a while. I missed you. Last time I battled with you was with Lance. I mean, we beat him yesterday. I'm just saying. Yeah, okay, so let's go with that Surf Attack right here. Surf Attack. Away, and there goes that Golem. KO. And luckily it doesn't have that, uh, that sturdy effect right now, because that would have been bad. Not bad, but you know, you know what I mean. And this guy's like, well, that's too much to handle. It is. It's too much to handle, homeboy. Let's ask him. I wonder if there's any mountains in Can worth climbing in Kanto. There is. There really is. I mean, there's Rock Tunnel. Um, blah, you know. Blah, Mount Moon, Mount Moon. There's a mountain right there, yeah. And this place is abandoned here, too. Okay, so we don't need to go right here. We need to go down here. Actually, you know what? We're gonna skip that, and we're gonna go through every single floor, and let's talk to this guy right here. Hey, what's up? What's up, guy? The passengers are trainer, or all trainers. They're all itching for to battle in the, in their own cabins. Okay, so I already got that picture right. Or, or, and here's a guy that ran over me. He's like, oh, hello. I still can't find my granddaughter. If she's on the ship, that's okay. She's an energetic child, so she may be bugging someone. Yeah, I'm worried. Okay, she's gonna be uh, bugging anybody. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna move on, and I'm gonna. Uh, of course, it's gonna be our, our, you know, our uh, duty to actually find this book or this this girl. So, Lexi, we're gonna switch it up to Relic right here. You know, the most powerful Pokemon I have right now because, you know, wanted to evolve him into a Espeon at first, and here we go. He's like, hey, kid, want to battle with me? Okay, let's do this. Bring it on, homeboy. And here we have Pokefan Colin, and he's gonna be coming out with his Delibird. There's no escape from this one right here. Now I wonder, oh wait, that's his bag. I thought that was like an icicle. I thought he was gonna stab me. Literally thought he was gonna stab me. So here we go with the Psychic Attack. That's right. That didn't, that didn't feel so good to the Delibird right there. Delibird deleted. Delete, 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 that's right. And uh, let's see, that was it. Okay, alright. He's like, you're strong! Yes, I am. I'm the champ. Okay, we have twins, but we're not double battling right here. And here we have, you think I'm a baby? That's not fair. Well, you kind of look like a five-year-old. I mean, you're still a baby, you know? That kind of thing. And here we have tw twins Meg and Peg want to battle. Meg and Peg sending out Teddy Ursa. Wow, I could have just, I could have used my Ursa rank. Really should have. Would have been awesome. But instead, I got Relic right here, and uh, let's go with the Headbutt right here. Finish him. Finish him. Finish him. And there goes Teddy Ursa. Not a, not a good death right there. It's not a death. It's not a good fainting. And here we have a Fan Fee. So they're both baby Pokemon. Of course, everybody's going to think you're a baby because you got baby Pokemon. Cute Pokemon, you know? You don't want to evolve them because they're going to be all mature, and you're not. I mean, not right now. And here we go with the Surf. Say goodbye to your Fanfy. You're going down, Fanfy. Oh, yeah. And there goes Fanfy. Not feeling so good now. And, wow, Nessie nearly grew to level 47 right there. So close. Oh, we lost. Yes, you did. You lost badly. And we're getting a phone call from Mom, and she's like, Hey, hi, Draven, how are you? While shopping today, I saw this adorable doll, so I bought it with your money. Sorry, it's in your room. You'll love it. Okay, I probably should have... Nah, never mind. I'm not even going to do anything over there. Okay, let's move on right here. And we're going to talk to that guy. Let's see who we, who we have to battle in here. Oh, it's abandoned. Never mind. Okay, let's go right here. Is it abandoned? No, there's a trainer looking for me. I'm just going to be hiding and seeing if there's any kind of items right here. And there's nothing. Okay. Let's go with our, our main man right here, Cinder. Going with Cinder right here, and... Hello! I'm going to Kanto to put on a fire-breathing shows. Okay. Well, I'm going to Kanto to reclaim my championship yet again because people think that I lost it to Lance and stuff. You know, people keep on calling me the false, uh, the false Pokemon champion. I don't know. I've never left anywhere. That kind of stuff. Cinder! Fire Punch. Oh yeah, I love that Fire Punch. And Fire Punch does coughing dirty. Look at that, coughing is coughing. 
And, uh... Get Thunder Gross level 50, finally. And, uh, who do we have next? Oh, it's coming out with a Flareon, so I'm gonna go with Nessie, because Nessie needs to grow another level. Oh, my God. Really does. And, uh... Well, Flareon's looking at me all, uh, cockeyed and everything, ready, wanting to fight. So we're gonna go with the Surf, and, wow, quick attack, seriously. Is it because Nessie's a little fatty? I'm just asking, is it a little fatty? And bam! There we go. Flareon has been defeated. That's right. That's right. Look at that. Okay, and uh, more Kid Thunder experience points right there. And he's going to be coming out with his coughing, so let's go with... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go with Relic. That's right. We're going with Relic. The uh, ultimate escape or the ultimate cheat code right here. Relic. Here we go. Psychic attack. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. That's a big bang right there. That is a big bang right there. And, uh, well, that's the end of Fire Breather Lyle. And he's going to be like, Fizzle! The flame's tiny. Wow, you don't want to say that in front of women, all right? So I'm going to move on right here. And that was the last floor right there. Okay, so we need to find this little girl before she run or she makes a whole mess of things. And uh, go right here. And uh, as you can see, there's another room right there. And this guy right here is gonna be like, nope, 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 nope. Uh, seriously, man, come on. All right, let me talk to you. He's like, hey, kid, could I get you? Uh, could I get you to look for my buddy? He's going off somewhere. That lazy bum. I want to, I want to go find him, but I'm, I'm on duty right now. Okay, nope, nope, juke, nope. Okay, so he's not letting us through, so we're gonna have to find his buddy, and I think he's in one of these abandoned rooms somewhere. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Nope, he's not gonna tell us anything. Okay, I'm, 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 gonna, I'm assuming it's gonna be right here. He's sleeping somewhere. Um, right here. No, we already battled these guys. And, okay, we've already been in this room. Where could he be? He's probably in my, he's probably in my room. If he's in my room, I'm going to be really angry right here. Okay, how about this room? Ah, there he is. Okay, he wants, he's going to want a battle right here. And uh, we're going to have to switch it up to talk to Batman. I'm battling with everybody right now because it's 2019. Everybody's got to get something. Yeah, I'm a sailor. All right. I wasn't goofing off. This cabin was vacant, so I just took a quick nap. Ah, forget it. Let's battle. Wow, these guys are so eager uh, eager to battle. I'm just like, I'm, I'm, I'm scared. I'm kind of scared. So here we have Sailor Stanley. He wants to battle. And he's coming out with his Machop. Look at that. Little Buff Bagwell right there. For those who don't know Buff Bagwell, professional wrestler. WCW. Read it up. And here we go with the wing attack. Oh, yeah. That wing attack is going to do some damage. Super damage. Bye bye Machop. Machop been defeated and Toxic Batman looking like a pimp right here. And this guy's coming out with his Psyduck. I'm going to take, I'm going to stay with my Toxic Batman right here. Fun fact. Did you, did you guys know that both Psyduck and Golduck's names are in reverse for the Pokemon? That was a, that was a, that, that, that was surprising for me. And I don't have a bite attack right here. Okay. Alright, he's gonna go with confusion. Almost hits me with that confusion. But here's that fly attack. Fly attack. Oh, yes. Bye bye, Psyduck. And, uh. Well, that's pretty much it, right? No, he's got one more. Coming out with his macho, but Toxic Batman. Holding her ground like. I, should, I probably should have called her Toxic Woman Batman or something. I don't know. Didn't even see that. Here we go. Wing attack. The wing attack finishes him off. There we go. Okay. That's right. That's right. I'm feeling good about this. Everybody's getting experience points. And that's pretty much it. All right. So Sailor Stanley was defeated. He's like, sorry, it's all my fault. Yeah, it is, man. I've been trying to look for, for you. He's like, being a sailor, I have to do physical labor. It's exhausting. Well, then don't be a sailor. I'm just saying. I don't know. Huh, okay. Alright, so we're gonna have to move back down right here. Now that we've found that sailor, now I'm pretty sure the guy's gonna let us through. I don't know. Let's see. 
He's not juking us. Okay, so talk to him. He's like, thanks, kid. I chewed him out. Good, and he'll quit slacking off. A little girl? I may have seen her go by here. Hmm. Where could she be? There's this guy throwing up right here. And, uh... Well, not right here. But I'm pretty sure this guy wants to battle me. He's like, Ugh! Seasick. Sicko. You are a sicko. Don't touch me. No. Don't. Don't touch me. Here we have Juggler Fritz, and he wants the battle, coming with his, uh, Mr. Mime. Hey, Mr. Mime, where's Mrs. Mime? That is the question right there. If it's a female Mr. Mime, would you call it a Mrs. Mime? I'm just asking. You just let me know down, down, down below, guys. Just let me know. And, well, there's that light screen that we didn't want to happen. Self def or special defense, so is my special or a physical? Looks like it's special. Yes, yes. Oh yeah, and uh, Kid Thunder right here, you know, not doing anything, and this guy's gonna come out with his Magmar, so I'm gonna go with Nessie. Nessie, do your thing. Be a man, or a woman, or I don't know what you are. Are you a woman? Are you a female? Let me see. No, you're a male. Be a man. Let's go. Take care of this butt head right here. Yeah. We all want, we all thought about it. Magmar, you are a butt head. And uh, Butthead got his butt kicked. That's right. You got your butt kicked. By Nessie. Uh-huh. And it's coming out with his Machoke. Let's go with... Relic. Hmm. I'm surprised that they didn't make uh, Machoke's pegs, like, you know, go up and down. Because that's, like, the biggest thing on him. And here we go. Psychic attack. Does that psychic tap uh, attack do anything? And yes, it does. Macho has been defeated. And, uh, yeah. That's pretty much it. Juggler Fritz is like, oh, I can't move anything anymore. Yeah, that's pretty much. All right, talk to you. He's like, no more ships for me. Next time, I'm you. I'm taking the magnet train. Hmm. What is this magnet train? And uh, should I? I am. There's nothing in here. But seriously, you're not throwing up, homeboy. Jeez. Exaggerating. So so dramatic. And here we have another sailor. But there's no items right here. I thought there was supposed to be any like a few items that we could find here, but I've been lied. I feel betrayed. Alright, let's go back to Teddy. And talk to this guy. And he's like, nothing beats a battle with when I'm on, on break. Oh wow. Totally misread that right there. So sorry. So sorry. Very, very sorry, guys. And here we have Sailor Jeff wants the battle. He's coming out with his Raticate. Raticate, you're gonna get butt kicked. You're gonna get your butt kicked right here, homeboy. So I hope you're ready, because here's the faint attack, and wow, didn't see that coming, right? Quick attack. And, uh, well, here we go. Faint attack does its damage. And here we go with an earthquake, but this guy's gonna just keep on going with his quick attack. He knows he's about to get defeated. Oh, yes. Say bye bye. Oh yes, I love that. I love that. Bye bye bye. Backstreet Boys and all that stuff. Boy and Sing, right? I can't really remember. Shoot. And I, and I lived through that era. Wow. Okay. Here we have another rat I'm guessing he's. Oh no. He's not gonna use a quick attack. So here we go. Earthquake. Is this a fatality? Am I hearing a fatality? Fatality. That's right. Fatality. And get done to being lazy, not doing anything. Jeff's like, win or lose, my break's over. Okay. Let me talk to you. See, I guess I can't win if I don't get serious. Okay, well, I'm really serious about this. I really am. And, uh, well, let's see. I'm probably going to battle her. And, you know what? Let's go with Kid Thunder. He hasn't even battled yet, right? Nope. And here we have, I'm, well, I'm so bored. Want to battle? All right. Let's do this. Play the hokey pokey right here, and uh, well, here we have Picnic Deborah, Deborah, uh, Debra, Picnic Deborah, Debra, and I chose correctly. Holy crap, I chose correctly. This is awesome. And uh, alrighty, let's get it. Thunderbolt attack. Thunderbolt does it great, and Thunderbolt destroys Sea Queen. Seriously, they need to change up the names of the male and female versions of these Pokemon because main. Yeah. How could it be a king if it's a woman? I don't know. 
I don't know. And she's like, wow, you're so strong. I am strong. I really am strong. Feel my muscles. Saffron, Celadon, I hear there are many big cities in Kanto. There is. I should have known because I was there. And uh, I think this is the last place right here. And, well, we come into the uh, captain's office right here. And there she is. She's playing around with the guy. She's like, Captain, play with me, please. I'm bored. I want to play more. Hi, will you play with me? Oh, Grandpa's worried about me. I have to go. I have to go find Grandpa. All right, we're going to go find Grandpa. And next thing you know, we find Grandpa. And Grandpa's like, Grandpa, I here I am. I was playing with the, the captain and this guy. Hmm. You know, I have a name, you know? Draven, was it? Uh, Draven, was it? I hear, I heard that you're entertaining my granddaughter. I want to thank you for that. I know I'd like you to have this. We get ourselves the Metal Coat, and for those who don't know, it powers up any kind of steel type moves. Or it evolves an Onyx to a Steelix, or it evolves a Scyther into a, what, a Scizor. But that's through trade, that's two new trade kind of things right there, so, yeah. And uh, after that, here we have Fast, or fast Ship SS Aqua has arrived in Vermilion City. Hmm, would you look at that? And talk to this guy, he's like, we're traveling around the world. Talk to her. I had lots of fun playing. Okay. So we only get one thing right here? Really? I thought that we would get more. I don't know. Okay, well, I'm gonna go back to the captain and see if he gives me anything. I don't know. He's probably gonna give me something like, hey, thank you for telling that girl to shut up or something. I don't know. So let's go back here. And... Here's the captain, and what do you have to say? Whew, thanks for coming along! Keep uh, Keeping that little girl amused was exhausting. Really? That's all you have to say? You're not gonna give me, like, uh, an item? Just for your thanks? You know, that kind of thing? Alright, Jerk's flipping you off. I'm flipping you off. Okay, so that's pretty much it for the SS title or SS Aqua right here. And we are finally back into Vermilion City now. Um, let me see if this is correct. The map says we are still in New Bark Town, but look at that. Look at that ship right there. Look at that. I wonder how we got there. Okay. We have to move all the way right here because we are in Vermilion City. It's the first right here. How long has it been since we've been in Vermilion City? It's been a while. And we talked to this guy. He's like, Fast Ship SS Aqua has arrived in Vermilion City. Alrighty. And first thing you notice is the change in song. Well, now that we are in Kanto, guys, let's see if I can surf right here. Oh, we can surf. Look at that. We can surf. First thing you notice in Kanto is the change in music, especially in battle music and all that stuff. Uh, to be honest, right here in Kanto, this is one of my favorite places because the music here is better than the one in Johto. I'm just saying that. And this guy's like, you came from Johto? I hear many rare Pokemon live over there. Hmm, that's true. That is true. But I hear there's more rare Pokemon here. I'm from Bellatown, homeboy. I don't know. I don't think you know if you know that. If you knew that, then that's awesome. And, uh, well, let's see. What do you have to say right here? The fast ship sails Wednesdays and Sundays every week. Oh, okay. It's Monday right now. Or Tuesday. Or as I'm recording right now, it's Monday the 31st. It's 2018, but as like, my, like I said in the beginning, Happy New Year's, guys. It's the first. Whatever. Um, so here we are, back in Vermilion City. The champ has returned, and, uh, well, a lot of things have changed, and, uh, a lot of things is gonna escalate by the next episode, so stay tuned, guys. We're finally in Kanto, and we're finally gonna make some noise here, so thank you guys for watching, Happy New Year's, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. See you guys. Thank <laughs> you.